Samantha and Tyler stand here under an open sky to give recognition to all the moments prior to this one in which they have already labored and loved to get here, using this purposeful ceremony to mark today as a milestone. Samantha and Tyler, it was four years ago when you first initiated a romance. Since then, you have been thriving on each other's presence and refuge, loving and learning, and realizing at some point along the way that life's trials aren't so threatening as long as you have a safe space within each other. By nature, it is impossible to know what's around the next bend, but with a trusted partner by your side, you can take comfort in the unknown. That is the glory of love. In marriage, effort, commitment, and unending respect are required. And it will flourish when each partner chooses to value the other for everything that they are and for everything they are not. And by entering into this promise today, you have now taken the initial step in what will be a wonderful and rewarding lasting life together. Today is one brief day in time. And although your vows are spoken in a matter of minutes, they are promises that will last a lifetime. Samantha, today, Tyler takes you to be his wife, promising to love and grow with you all of his days, to support you through times of trouble and rejoice with you in times of happiness, cherishing what he knows about you and trusting what is still to be discovered. Do you embrace this man as a lovely wedding husband? I do. You may slide on the ring, and as you do, please state, with this ring, I thee wed. With this ring, I thee wed. Tyler, today, Samantha takes you to be her husband, promising to love and grow with you all of her days. She support you through times of trouble and rejoice with you in times of happiness, cherishing what she knows about you and trusting what is still to be discovered. Do you embrace this woman as your lawfully wedded wife? I do. You said on the ring, and as you do, please stay. With this ring, I do what? With this ring, I do what? So by the power of your love and commitment to each other, and by the power that's in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You make his your wife. Shortly after I met Samantha, I started going through one of the hardest times of my life. And um, Samantha never once let me go through that alone. She showed up at my house. She would text me and call me daily. She'd send me little cards in the mail. Like, who does that, right? <laughs> but she gave me that support when I didn't even know I needed it. She was my rock, and she, I don't even think she knew that. And if it wasn't for the type of person she is, I know that there would be a very different version of myself up here today. This is also why I know she's gonna be an amazing wife because she's never going to let you fail in anything that you wanna do. She's gonna forgive you when you don't even deserve it. And, <laughs> and I know that I'm still gonna be crashing their gates in 30 years from now. <laughs> Cheers, you guys, I love you. When Tyler met Sam in seventh grade, um, I knew he had an eye for you. Um, I tried to tell him you were popular, hang out with cool kids, and, and all we do is play all we do is play hacky sack. And she probably doesn't think you're tricky. <laughs> Fast forward, look at you guys now. Uh, Tyler has always been a great son um, to his parents, a great brother to his sisters, a great friend to all of us. And uh, seeing the smile that you put on his face, um, I know without a doubt. Congratulations.